See the beam. So I'll show you the measurement. You guys see that? It's 13 foot long. And it's pretty long. But the gamut match is still in good shape. I'm not trimming that at all. I still got it on the end on the, the loopy ends on the bottom here. It's in there. I have the part for it in the other bag here. So I have them all in here, guys. Yes, I do have them all. Before I do, I paint them. I'll put a frog tape on those gamut matches before I do anything. That's all it is. It's all in here. But I'll tell you, we'll get a fantastic show going. And also, I need a bunch of these. And I need some of these. And I found out these actually fit on the black ones. If you guys want to send a whole pack of them, I don't care. 60 packs of this. Shrink, key shrink wrap's good. I need a bunch of these. But maybe I'll get them later on when I get time. I need some of those. And that will fit on these no problem. So I saw a guy on a video put on his arm. Um, it was like several months ago I've seen this. It'll actually fit these and it'll actually fit on the big ones. So it keeps the water out of these things. So that's what I'm talking about, these quality. So I can put this here and heat shrink wrap. I don't think it's going to affect the performance. That's what I need to do. So I need to find a bunch of these things. And that's all I need. Say hi, champy boy. Say hi to the audience. He's the pug. I know you guys see him on video for a while. He does, he's been missing his buddy for a while. He does not like being alone. So you might guys see him on the radio shows a little bit more. So this guy's named Champ. He's about five years old. He was born in Planet Salt Lake City, Utah. So I'm going to tell 390 Wang mess about that. This was my brother's dog. My sister paid um, a good amount of money for him when she used to work a long time ago with Amazon. And the place she used to work at a slaughterhouse outside of Plain City, Utah. And before that, she was an FFA, um, F, um, what do they call it? Meat inspectors. She used to be at one for a year one time. Man, she could actually get any restaurant shut down if somebody does something bad. But mostly, she got out of the FFA inspectors and went to this local slaughterhouse in Plain City out there in the middle of nowhere. This is actually the cereal beams. This is what I wrote down. It's not middle micrometers. And we need to understand all the foot what this thing is supposed to be. I think the nine foot's gonna be the one in the back. There's two nine foots of these. You guys see it. I did it on the measure eight foot right there. I put another eight foot on that one there. No, that's the same eight footer right here, guys. Don't mistake that. So these are two eight footers. And this one's called 8 foot 106 inches and 3 eighths. Same thing with this one here. You guys know what that is? I think that could be the director or something like that. And that's what I have. This is 8 foot 100 inches. This could be the front one or the middle one. We don't know which one it is. Maybe Jungle Joe give me an idea. So say hi to all the audience. Wave the hands out there. So that's uh, Champ the Doggy. He just wants to be on camera. He just likes to hang out with me for a while. That's what it is. We might be able to see him a little bit more on our DX screens when we get some time. There's my giant iron. That thing works good. And still love to get this two rayer working. These rayers are doing great. But we need to get this guy working. And that guy down there working for sure. The one with the RCI 2950. And that guy the road talking that guy needs some new fixing too but these radios are okay I'm glad the grant is back I showed you back a few months ago it came back it's on lay, lay on relay the turner mic along the back the microphone's working here we need to get a few more of these RA middle bass you guys want to send me another one of them that'd be great then we can run this radio a little bit more and the other ones too but I don't know what a quad five would be a good box for them that's what I'm saying UGX 362 Way Mountain, East Tennessee. I'll be glad to get this beam going. If we can keep this argumentally a long time going, maybe we can have some backup spare parts this guy. That would be great. I would love to have backup spare parts that argumentally. But I know 3 may might be able to help my Silver Eagle. I don't know. Maybe you can get this thing working back again, but it still works on the low power thing, but it just blows fuses on that thing I showed you. And that's actually 14 gauge wire. 
because I bought it from a guy off of Facebook Marketplace for 25 bucks. What do you expect? It came from a hammy ham. And it was not my fault when it happened when I turned up the turn mic when I was trying to get all the other, you know, guys, how the skip goes crazy. When I first had that, it was doing good. And I turned it down by eight between that. But the argument is doing fantastic right now. Maybe you get some pills working here, I don't know. But Artemilly, this is my amp thing I bought from Phone Farm a while back. You guys know that when I told you. One was not free, and one was one was actually free for $97. The other one was not free for $40. That probably was the $97 one I have. And it's pretty good. I'll catch you guys later. Maybe DXN's kind of acting weird. Maybe I'll love to have some meter lights in this thing. I will put the meter lights in if you guys want to get me some. And especially this one too. This is all crystals. I hope the lights do come back. But it would be nice. And this is UDX 362. I'll catch you guys all later. Have a great Friday weekend. Happy Friday weekend. And I'm going to buy doing some more videos sometime soon. But I hope we'll get the series going. But I'm supposed to get some more poles here later on soon. I showed you part of the one I have to do. But in this heat, you can't do that much in this extreme heat. It's kind of hot, and I'm pretty sweaty right now on this porch. So I'll catch you guys later. This is UDX 362 from East Tennessee. Fox 1362 rolled over on YouTube. I'll catch you all later.